Hey guys, Bane here. Um, I'm bringing you a are you battle, I think. Yeah, it's an are you battle with a couple of new folks. But um, yeah, it features my belly drum clefable, which unfortunately um, doesn't do too much, but it's still pretty cool. Um, so yeah, this is uh, against Belak. Um, now here I was, I was trying to pull off the clefable sweep, right? So I naturally loaded with Ninjask and did my uh, substitute bullshit. Um, unfortunately, uh, he has a Drifalim. So, uh, the one problem with my Clefable set is that it's completely and utterly walled by ghost types. It can take on anything else, but just ghost types, like, get the fuck out. It's done. Um, so anyway, I just go for a ba safe baton pass into my Hotchcrow. He goes for the Haze again, and I'm like, you know, whatever. I go for a sub here. Uh, he goes for a Destiny Bond, predicting, like, a Brave Bird or something, and he just wants to take me out. But I go for the Roost. Um, here he goes for another Destiny Bond, and I go for another sub. So that's pretty cool. Um, he goes for the acrobatics right here, and I go for the brave bird, taking him out. So no uh, destiny bond bullshit. Don't don't have to deal with that. Um, so here he sends out him only, and I go into ninjask, predicting like a fighting move. He's, he's scarfed or a fake out, which I can live. This is max HP, max speed ninjask. So um, I can pretty much take take uh, anything I I really want. Uh, so anyway, here he sees that I'm doing my, my substitute protect ninjask shit, so he goes for blaze kicks instead of stone edges. Well, here he goes for stone edge, so that's not entirely true, but he's kind of rotating between the two so he doesn't run off PP too fast. Now, um, here I go for another protect, and he goes for a blaze kick, and I'm like, you know, whatever, fuck a blaze kick, right? Um, and I bat and pass here, and luckily I predicted correctly, and he goes for another blaze kick, and it does not break my sub because Moltres is awesome. Now here I go for an air slash, and uh, thank god I managed to keep that sub up, because I missed the air slash, and he goes for a stone edge, and hits, but lucky for me I'm able to air slash on the next turn, and I'm at like a bunch of speed, and I'm spec, so I can almost sweep, but he cock blocks me a bit which with Honchkuro, I'm fearing a sucker punch, so I go into Ninjask, and Ninjask uh, doesn't get hit by the sucker punch, because of the switch, obviously, so I restart with the substitute shit. Um... Yeah, here I go. I go for sub. Yeah, I go for sub. And he goes for the brave bird. Now, um, I'm just like, you know, whatever. Brave bird. Fuck you, brave bird. Uh, here I should have predicted the roost and gone for another sub because I had enough health to make a sub. But I did not do that. So actually, no, I didn't have enough health to make a sub. So protect was the right move. Never mind. Um, but I go for another uh, sub here. He goes for the brave bird, and uh, you know, I'm just trying to get enough. Uh, enough stuff so I can go into Newt Gingrich, Michael Fable, and just like start wrecking shit. Um, now lucky for me, I outspeed pretty much everything on his team at this point because I have all the speed boosts, so here I plan to life orb stall him. Uh, you know, but unfortunately for me, somehow his he doesn't take any recoil from that, I guess. That was weird, but um, so he should have died to recoil and life orb recoil, but I guess is he is he not life orb? He is life orb. What the fuck? I sh I should have been able to pull off this sweep. Whatever, doesn't matter. Um, so so anyway, I'm just like he's going for sucker punches, and you know he's, he's sort of predicting me very well. So you know that kind of blows because I'm not able to get off any belly drums. Had I predicted the sucker punch properly, then I'd be able to get off a uh, belly drum and just you know kick the shit out of them and be amazing. But um. Here, you know, we continue. I go for a facade here, unboosted, and still does a really good chunk, so I'm happy about that. I have no attack investment, by the way. Max defense. Uh, special defense might be better, I don't know. But, whatever. Um, so he goes for the suck. Oh, right, a max defense to take a, to live mock punches and shit like that, right? That's why max defense. I remember now. Um, so anyway, he goes into Entei, and he takes me out with an extreme speed after I life orb and recoil kill the punch crow, and Entei takes him out. But you know, I'm like, whatever, that's fine. Um, he, go, I go for an air slash here, and I, I thought that he was choice, but he's not choice. Which you know, I was like, oh shit, it's not edge, right? But it missed, so that was that was good for me. Uh, he goes for an E speed here, and I take him out with an air slash. And now you know, I'm pretty sure I can. I can just kill everything, but just to be safe, I want, I'm kind of a score whore, so. He goes for the Calm Mind. He shows me that it's sort of a. It's like a stored power set, I guess. 
But I go for the Drain Punch, and I don't give a fuck because I'm adamant and I have Iron Fist, and I can just kick the shit out of everything. I'm max HP, max attack. I don't even have any speed investment, so that's how much of a baller I am. But I do have Mock Punch, so, uh. Anyway, that was the game. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I'll try and. I think I'm gonna. I have a Clefable Sweep that that's eventually gonna get recorded fully. Well, it's, it's already been recorded, it just needs to be edited and shit. And I can put that on my channel, and it features me, you know, 6 owing like a ton of people. Like, like that. That's Glyphable, and he's just fucking ride-ons, and it's amazing. But, um, anyway, so that's, that's my battle. Um, hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, that's it for now. That's it for me. <laughs> sort of sounding like Lane now, from the game station. Okay, I'm rambling. Um, uh, see you guys. Take it easy.